It's time to chase the lottery cards, everybody. You feel that? We gotta find them. Are they in here? Are they flipping in here? Tim! Thank you, sir, and uh, good luck one of my international patrons. Um, this is most likely gonna be a private video just for him because he wants to try to see how his luck goes. And Tim, good luck, sir. I wish you the best. And, uh, yeah. Obviously, uh, we still got a lot of good uncommon, especially Fatal Push holding strong here, especially out of rotation. And um, we'll see how it goes. Without further ado, we're jumping in, everybody. Good luck, sir. Good flipping luck. All right, let's get these. Oh, let's get everything ready here. And here we go. Do do do. Well, Fatal Push first pack. That's nice. And Renegade. Wow. Foil Revolution and Land Token. Wow, okay. <laughs> First pack, fatal push. Boop. That's the way we like to play. Alright. Trophy design. Just the recruits. Land and token. Alright, here we go, here we go. Ornithopt. Uh, oh, gifted Aetherborn. That's nice. And Undying Potashin. Foil. Uh, evasion. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Man, we're getting some killer uncommons, everybody. Talk about a really strong uncommon start. Another fatal push? Holy smokes! Chief of Compliance. Beautiful forest. Wow. Holy crap. Two fatal pushes in like four packs? <laughs> that's... That's, uh... That works out now, doesn't it? Engineer, Ventional, uh, the Revolution, and that's it. Hmm. Oh, what a start, everybody. What a flippin' start. Alright. Ah, Peace Walker and a Foil Admiral. Hmm. Alright, Specialist Keeper Reverse. A Johnny the Unwielding. Where's our first Mythic? Holy smokes. Uh, Tim, you just might be a lucky guy. That's all I really have to say. You just might be a lucky dude. Look at that. Senior at a Fisher. Very nice. Very nice. And I just dropped a pack of cards. And you know what's really funny about that pack of cards? Let's put it... Sorry about that. Okay. Resume. And... Um, Revolutionary Dreadnought pair of this. And uh, inspiring a statue out. Statuary? Statu statutary? It was statuary? All right, Engineer, Rebel, Awakening, and the Miner. Hmm. Well, so far, not bad, not bad. Actually, a pretty strong box, actually, so far. Metallic Mimic, boom, there's a strong hit. Wow. This is a pretty strong box, everybody. Tim, you got beginner's luck, sir. Wow, Aether Heart, Mythic number two. Ooh, I thought that was a... Uh, just a foil intruder, uncommon. Hmm. All right, here we go. Waiting for something crazy, everybody. Glint sleeve and a foil automaton. And a nice little emblem guy. I think it's like a quarter. It's a nice quarter. Maybe a few extra pennies. Uh, the whale, the swamp, and the energy token. Hmm. Alright. Revolutionary Arcade Intervention. Well, I feel like we're kind of stalling out. All our oomph from the beginning there feels like we just kind of slowed down. Everybody's favorite. Felidoa Guardian. Dock hand. Oops. Sorry, mixed up my piles a little bit. Are we? I don't think I've ever seen a box with more than, like, I think the most I've ever seen. Walking Ballista, wow. Holy smokes, are we getting, like, every good card in the set? We get a Paradox Engine, I think. That's going to be, like, a trifecta, man. We hit, like, everything. Quick Smith Spy. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, Fatal Push. I think, on average, I've seen one to two per box. One or two times I saw a three per box, but that's about it. They don't really come up that often. Secret Salvage, Foil, Beautiful-looking Island. Hmm, shock, let's see. Here we go. What was this guy? Oh, that's still common. Haha. 
Intruder, Tesserets, and the Crackdown. Wah, wah. All right, here we go. Shielded, Regain. Yeah, expertise, not bad, not bad. No foil. Well, we are pushing, uh, what are we? Past halfway through box one. I'd be surprised if we actually get like a lottery card or something crazy, considering I think lottery cards on Aether, Kaladesh, or what? One in every four boxes, I think. So the odds are not very good unless you open like at least six boxes or something. Scrap Trawler. And even then, you know, you can get a $20 one instead of a $100 one. You know, there's no real way to, you know, even when I've seen boxes, people get one and it still doesn't turn a profit. Word of Invention. And that's it. So... But, more than anything, I mean, two Fatal Pushes, is a, that's, that's a nice bump on box value. And Battle of the Bridge. Alright, last chunk of the box. Last one-third. Okay. Alright, here we go. Hidden Stockpile. Oops, oh man, I skipped an Uncommon. Please hold. Ooh, Foil Row, that's a Foil Rare. Oh, the Harvester. Oh man. And hang on, everybody. I, um... Crap, I keep mixing my lands up on the foils. I don't know why I keep doing that. It drives me crazy. Sorry, I, got, I dropped an uncommon in the common pile. I want to make sure it wasn't a good one. Uh, no, just a trophy. Mate. I was like, wait a minute. Don't want to mix up something major there. Okay. Didn't want to miss like a third fatal push if I skipped one card. That would be my luck. All right, here we go. Hmm. All right. Uh, siege. Aid from the Cowl. Hmm. Well, we swung and missed on the uh, full rare. That's a letdown. Ooh, gifted Aetherborn. That's nice. And another Chief of Compliance. Wow, two of the same rare. That's unusual on newer boxes. So you got two Fatals and two um, gifted Aether. That's actually, uh, that's really good, actually, for one box. Uh, the Basker is a Mythic. Well, that's three Mythics. The average box has between three and four, so we're running out of Mythics. We want that um, Paradox engine, definitely. And not the Karazev. Karazev! Alright. Let's see here. Ornithopter, Wind Aerial, and Expertise. Expertise. Well, home stretch, everybody. Not looking like we're gonna get anything uh, in the lottery realm. Midnight Entourage, but overall, this was a strong box. Definitely going to be a strong box. We've got uh, the double Fatal Push and the double, I mean, the good uncommon slot alone. Yeah, another bridge. Wow, we got some duplicate rares. That's unusual for Aether. Usually, I don't remember ever really getting duplicate rares in the same box of Aether. That's kind of strange, everybody. Hmm. That's definitely a little unusual. And another Harvester, this time <laughs> non-foil. I'm going to have to clean up these packs. I'm making a huge mess down here before I start the next block. Dark Intimidations! A Foil Mobile Garrison. Last pack of box one. Not a bad box, Tim. Not a bad box, man. And... Uh, hey, okay. I was like, wait a minute. Fourth Mythic. Mechanized Production. Well, you got four Mythics. All right, let me clean this up because I've got... Uh, my piles are just a disaster. Hang on a second. All right. Packs, the piles look a lot nice for everybody. Holy smokes, I had crap everywhere. All right. All right, Tim, good luck, sir. Uh, honestly, that first box, I think, was actually pretty, uh, that was pretty good, man. Like, I was looking at the packs and everything, and I was like, straight, and I was like, wait a minute, does it have to have the, first of all, the double fatal, the double, um, gifted aether? I thought that was a, a really, really strong start. That's just my opinion. All right, let's get the focus real nice. You guys ready? Alright. Round two. Here we go. And starting with the revolution. Leaving dust. Alright. Ornithopta, Felaha, Guardian, and the intervention. No foil. You know, on a side note, and like I said, I know this is a private video for you, Tim, and everything, but still, I was like, you know, with, I think the Kaladesh Aether block, compared to the Ixalan and the Amon Ket Hour of Devastation, is definitely going to be the strongest block in the last few years as time goes on and these cards age. This is definitely going to be the... Ooh, Fatal Push! 
All right. Just my opinion, though. I really think the, um, I think Kaladesh and Aether are probably going to age the best, I think, compared to all the modern stuff. You know, Midnight Entourage. Foil Swampy, everybody. Where's my foil? Oh, there it is. But yeah, I just feel like the power level and the uniqueness and the energy and the, and the pulling in the vehicles. And I think this is going to really age very well compared to the other ones. That's all. Liberator. Hmm. Come on, give us something crazy. Something crazy. Expertise and a foil automation. Something crazy. That's what we're looking for, everybody. Something crazy. All right, here we go. All right. Ooh, ah, oh, wait. I, just, I was like, wait a minute. An angel. I was like, wait a minute. That's a mythic. Squizzit Archangel. That is our first mythic. Nothing too crazy there, but at least it's a mythic. Better than not getting one. Quicksilver Rebel. All right, here we go. Come on, good stuff. Inspiring. Oh, it's the same rare we got in the other box. It's like that's a letdown. Am I right? Renegade. And green. Oh, that's a cool looking elephant, dude. Not really worth anything, but still cool looking. All right, here we go. Specialist. Giant, reverse engineer, Herald of Anguish. That is mythic number two. Boy, we're talking about the opposite of the mythics of the other box, am I right? Man, talking about swinging and missing on the mythics. All right, here we go. Trophy Mage, Monstrous Hidden, and Merchant's Dockhand. All right. Oops, did I go too far? Thought I went too far, everybody. Plunder, Admiral, Flame, Walking Ballista. There we go. There we go. Definitely going to age very well. That card is going to be uh, and a screaming, creepy, Rudy guy. Walking Ballista, that, that card's always going to hold its value. It's such a unique card. I mean, it just reminds me of Hangerback Walker. The Colossus. And nothing else. Actually, you know what? Hangerback Walker didn't age as well. It kind of cooled off pretty quickly afterwards, didn't it? Tezzerat! There we go. We didn't see you in the first box. You got an Ajani in the first box. We got a Tezzerat in the second one. Wow, three Mythics again. Man, that's a good sign already. Halfway through the box, three Mythics. Might be looking at a five Mythic box, everybody. Fatal Push! Boom! Four Fatal Pushes in two boxes. Holy smokes, that is fantastic. Wow. Okay. Oh, wow, that is... That's something you don't see every day. And Paradox Engine! Holy God, yes. Okay, fourth Mythic. We got the best, most expensive Mythic in the set right now. Wow. Okay, this is, uh, boy, talk about a good box, everybody. And Vigil and Aid from the Cowl, and that is it. Wow, what a good box, too. Holy crap, everybody. All right, and a Whir of Invention. Womp womp. All right, Savage Scuttler, Harpooner, Reckless Racer, and the Miner with a foil. Oh, I was like, ooh, we got something big. And a foil Ridge Scale Tusker. That's a foil that nobody cares about. Probably 99 pennies. Oops, don't want to make sure. Okay. All right, Restoration Specialist Engraved, Expertise, and a foil Alley Strangler. Well, we're down to the last about 12 packs. Um, honestly, <laughs> these are two good boxes, man. Carry Zev. Foil! Oh my god! Oh, jeez! Foil Walking Ballista. Most expensive rare in the set in foil. Home run. Holy crap. Dude, Tim, congratulations, man. That is l epic. Epic pull. Holy crap. Boy, that came out of nowhere. Holy smokes, everybody. The Johnny, nobody cares. Wow, a foil walking ballista. It's like one in every, what, 50 boxes or something? Ooh, gifted Aetherborn. Holy smokes. Quicksilver Spy. 
Wow. Woo, man. Foil flying ballista. That is epic, everybody. And call for unity and a foil Aetherheader. Man, I cannot believe a foil ballista. Holy smokes. Champion Renegade Glint Slee. Oh, Glint Siphon. Well, we're down to the last stack of packs. What a good batch of two boxes. Wow. And Metallic. <laughs> of course, we want to make sure we don't miss a good card. Tim's like, look, I only get all the good cards in a box opening. I don't want to miss one. Oh my god, that's awesome. What an awesome box opening. This is super cool. And, hey, another Mythic. Is this, in, I mean, it's a crappy creativity myth, but I mean, that's Mythic number five? Holy crap, what a good opening, man. Wow. Epic, epic, epic. And, ooh, Pima, wait, is this still a good card? It was like seven bucks at the beginning, I think. The Renegade, I think it went down in price because nothing ever happened with it. That was a good card. All right, one of Thopter modification, Secret Salvage, and that's it. Well, final, I think four more packs, and that's it. Oh, good job on the boxes, Tim. You, uh, I think you did pretty well. You made out pretty good, if you want my opinion. Uh, the Hope of Ginnipa, I think. I don't know how to pronounce that. Mm. Well, this was fun. Revolutionary Tezzeret, release the Gremlins. That's a cute card. Yeah, that cute card. All right, home stretch, everybody. And uh, the dragon dude that nobody cares. Last two packs. Man, so I think between those two boxes, do we get like 11 mythics, I think? So many mythics. Spire of Industry, not bad. We didn't even get that in the other box. Very last pack, everybody. All right, that is it. I hope everybody enjoyed the video. Eighth the Whale, Tim. Congratulations, dude. Seriously. I mean, four Aethers, three Gifted, and what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, five, nine Mythics in two boxes with a foil, flipping foil, walking ballista. Wow. All right, guys. Have a great day.